Welcome back to Holly Scoops Just Saying. I'm Heather Gardner. Hey, what's up? Dylan from Brooklyn. How you guys doing? I'm so happy to have you back. Oh my God, it's a real pleasure. And I'm so glad you're here to talk about creepy little seven-year-olds today. Really creepy. <laughs> it's exciting though. I mean, is there anything else to talk about than creepy seven-year-olds? Okay, before you get all crazy, this is not one of those videos. Listen, there was a seven-year-old girl who apparently is from Britain, but was on a Philippines reality show called this is a good one. Your face sounds familiar. It to is me. a great title. <laughs> that is a great title. I mean, because it just sums up exactly what it is. Your face sounds familiar. Basically, it's a kid's version of an impersonation show. Ah. So this little girl, her name is Ziomata. 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 Thank you, Ziomata, and she comes out and impersonates Taylor Swift. Although people are saying it's creepy and oversexualized. Let's play the clip and let you guys decide. I mean, first thoughts after seeing that? Well, I, I wouldn't say it's too over-sexualized, but I would say is Mata's doing her thing. She's seven years old. I'm sure she's a pageant girl, you know, doing her thing. The impersonation is not that bad as far as the outfits go and like her effort. Does she sound like Taylor Swift exactly? No. So does her face sound that familiar? Not really. But so, you know, but you're saying she up. shouldn't win the show, but what she's doing is fine. Uh, yeah, I'm sure her parents are <laughs> thrilled about everything. You know, they're really on uh, behind, the backstage parents, cheering her on. The parents are definitely um, on board because the money is just like rolling in. This video went viral this past week and it's got the attention of everybody, including, of course, Piers Morgan, who is, Piers Morgan, who is a British broadcaster. Ah. So he said it's overly sexualized and I kind of maybe have to agree with her, him. I mean, she's flipping her hair, she's pulling the clothes off. Yeah, I kind of agree with the father who said, uh, yeah, we don't really care about Piers Morgan, so I don't think anybody <laughs> else really does, so I'm with the father. Uh, but there's another video of Siomata dancing that I actually would See, take your side that is a little over -sexualized. Okay, here's the thing. Apparently, Siomata, for her being just seven years old, is like a professional impersonator. Yeah, good job, Siomata. Which is kind of impressive. She did Selena Gomez. Take a look at this one where she just gets all like, mm, booty shaking. But what, I'm, what I say here about this little girl is this was a year ago. She was on a different show called Mini Me, and she was six years old, shaking her little booty, going, if you're ready, come and get it. Yeah, well. I mean. But the question is, ooh. how would that affect her, like, growing up? You think as, as she grows up, her performance background, you know, being over-sexualized as a I mean, six-year-old might, might make a play? I think she might just turn into the next Selena Gomez, because her most recent Instagram photo, I mean, there was hardly anything left of the imagination there. Whoa, Selena. hey now. Hey now. Oh, Selena's. Uh, Selena. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Very enjoyable. Thank you, Selena. But and that's all, that could be a whole nother show, really. Talking about Selena's ass? Oh, we've been there. We've done that. Okay, guys, we want to hear from you on this one. First of all, tell him that he is a creep because for reals over here, do you think this little girl impersonating Taylor and Selena was appropriate? Just fun, kind of interesting to look at? Or do you think it's downright creepy like I do? Yeah. Well, what if you guys have your own impersonation videos? That'd be kind of cool to see. Maybe send those our way. Absolutely. You could, you could be the next CEO Mata. So, <laughs> hopefully a little more than seven years old. Okay, guys, subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.